it's our fifth anniversary. It went by fast, and we've known each other for seven years. Seems minutes. like just yesterday you were trying to break up with me every month. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, seems just like yesterday I was trying to get you to notice me. I wanted Mike to notice me so bad that I went into the break room where he was, and I accidentally dumped coffee all over my hand, and then he still didn't even notice. Like, I was this damsel in distress, and he didn't even... He didn't even notice. He was like, oh look, that girl's over there like dancing oddly in the corner. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm all for like, you know, self-empowered women. And <laughs> I wanted you to be empowered to save yourself. Oh my gosh, and <laughs> limbless, apparently. <laughs> I was just gonna lose my left arm. But you weren't gonna lose it. <laughs> so anyway, that story and more stories ab about us are in <laughs> your book. Yes, I thought it would be really awesome if I could give him a book during the middle of our wedding ceremony and I wrote the vows in the book. And so, what did you think of that? I thought that was a very unique way to <laughs> tell me you love me. Yeah, it was pretty hilarious. I remember, <laughs> you know, Mike said his vows and then I pulled out this book and read him the vows and then handed him the whole novel and I think it was my mom in the audience said, oh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> because what else would I do you know but anyways this is the book that I wrote for Mike it's called a stranger's kindness and since it's our anniversary we decided to put it up for a free download read about us <laughs> you wanna... you're you're very interested you're very... <laughs> Mike is working on his skills of hypnotism how is it going for you we want to know yeah comment below